Welcome back. This is Briston and Latondra Heaven, your co-presidents for the Central Florida Christian Chamber of Commerce. Last week was truly refreshing. First, let us say thank you to all who joined us for the professional development event hosted by our U.S. Christian Chamber of Commerce. We had a very engaging conversation around the impact of the U.S. economy and AI, artificial intelligence, on Christians doing business in the marketplace in these times and seasons. Yes, it was so good. And listen, if you missed part one, we want to make sure that you don't miss part two. You don't want to miss part two. So go and register for the July event. And we are planning to also make the recording for part one available to our members. So be on the lookout in your membership hub for that resource upload. Very good. Friends, the momentum is growing for Fellowship Friday. Last week, Fellowship Friday, hosted by Dawn Sipley, was truly amazing. We heard her story and we heard from both members and visitors ways in which they are seeing God move in their businesses. And I will say this, friends, a few tears were shed in that meeting. Absolutely. We're called to rejoice with those who rejoice and to weep with those who are, who are weeping. And it is always so good to celebrate what God is doing in the lives of others. Yes. So what's coming up? This Friday, July 7th, we have another Fellowship Friday, and they're just going to keep getting better and better, I'm sure. Our host this week would be Walkeria Cash Ward of Calgary Orlando Christian Academy. So go on and register, get all of the details, and we want to see you there. We're in July, yes, but we're still in the summer, which means that we don't have a luncheon this month. However... Registration is open for our August luncheon. And listen, it's going to be a big one. Mark Whitaker, who just so happens to be one of Briston's mentors and prayer partners. You don't want to miss this no, conversation um, that he's, he's, he's going to be having with us. Uh, Mark Whitaker, who is the VP of Culture and Care mm -hmm. with T-Factor and Coca-Cola Consolidated. That will be August 10th. So go on and register now. Excellent. So what is the verse for the week? It comes from Luke chapter 2, verse 52. And Jesus increased in wisdom and stature and favor with God and man. Friends, Jesus was about doing his father's business. Luke, the physician and historian, captured Jesus at the age of 12. And why was Jesus about his father's business? Because Jesus had an intimate relationship with the spirit of his father. Friends, you have an intimate relationship with the spirit of Jesus. So, do you know that the Holy Spirit is our unfair advantage in the marketplace? And how is the Holy Spirit our unfair advantage in the marketplace in the same way that he was for Jesus? When we are submitted to the Spirit of Jesus, something happens. Our obedience unlocks godly wisdom to make wise decisions. It unlocks the maturity of Christ so that others can see our character. And it unlocks favor with God and people. And friends, there are some doors that only God can open for you in your business. So, don't forget your unfair advantage in business who is the Holy Spirit. Walk in step with him this week. So who wants to pray this time? All right. So Father in heaven, we thank you so much for our members. Jesus was submitted to the spirit of his father and increased. Grant us, Lord God, the grace and the faith to walk in step with the spirit of Jesus and see the increase that you have prepared for us in our business, in the marketplace, to the glory of your name. In Jesus' name, amen and amen.